is a work of the Lord to pull down strongholds. Now, even as I'm navigating this vision, somebody named, uh, I don't know who's connected to, someone showed up in my vision last night with name uh, Julie. And I don't know who's praying for Julie, 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 Julie. If you're live, if you're watching from online, let me know. Get my volume just a little bit. I don't know who that is. Who's connected to Julie? Are you? Okay. Co-worker in and friend named Julie Anna. Does anybody call her Julie? Everyone else calls her Julie. Okay, come over here. Let me tell you about Julie. She showed up in my vision last night. Jesus. Have you, you prayed for her? She's praying for you. Do you all see that assignment? She's walking with an assignment on her. And God is, he's, he's uh, taking advantage of the moment. Do you see that? You guys come in here, you don't know you're a point of contact for someone next to you. Uh, you come in here and God says, okay, let me take advantage of this moment to speak to this situation. Can I tell you about Julie? Okay. You know she has kids. Because I saw two. I saw two. Two. Two boys. Somebody say prophesy. Prophesy. I saw two. Yeah. This is the Julie, you see? See that? Let me tell you about Julie because I saw a spirit trying to affect her. I don't know if she tried to have more kids or if she would if she was wanting to have more kids she did and they say that again she had a little girl but she lost her after a day now i want you to guys to see how prophetic this is bring my camera around i wrote in my notes children died i'm talking about julie bring that camera you can i don't know if you can get that Right here. So they'll believe me. Julie, children died. What seemed like two children and two girls. It wasn't just one, there was also a girl that I also believed it was a miscarriage. Didn't know if even if it was a miscarriage. Amen. Somebody say prophesy. Prophesy. Now, this was last night. I don't dream, so when God sends me a dream, I know it's I know. Amen. I'm not a dreamer, I'm a prophet. Amen. There's a difference. Dreamers dream and prophets can't have dreams and prophets dream dreams. But there's different dimensions. And God uses each gift differently. For me, I just know my gift. I don't dream. I don't just dream like... I dream. Everybody dreams. But when God brings things to my attention, it's for a reason. So when I do, when it does come forth, I know this is... Amen. So, I'm, so Julie showed up in my vision. The Lord spoke to me about her, spoke to me about the two babies. One of them she might not even know about because one, there was a miscarriage. There were two girls. One, the girl you were talking about, the one that died, that passed. The Lord said, I need to play, pray for this place. She currently has two children. Amen. I'm praying for this place. Is she currently married? She's widowed. Okay. Do you see the death around? You see this? This spirit of death flies from her today. Today. Is somebody hear me? Why would God bring this up to me? We're not just, we're not just looking at, there's a reason why God brings him. Why would he disturb me in my sleep? 5.15 a.m. in the morning, Julie shows up in my dream. The Lord says, you'll pray for this person in service today. She has two kids. Two of them pass. But there's a spirit of death around her house. Imagine this intercessor walks in here. Just a few words of prayer about Julie. God catches it up. And in a moment, this thing flies from her. Amen. How old is she? She's an older lady. There's a restoration coming. There's a restoration coming. For the Lord shall restore the wasted places. 
and the years and the things that the canker worm has eaten. Amen. In Jesus' almighty name. And Lord, we just thank you, Lord, for what you're doing. And we thank you for this intercessor in her heart. As you heard, the, heard her prayers, Father, and you're catching away this sound, Lord, uh, to remove the stronghold. And it shall not pass on to the boys, and it shall not pass on to the generation to follow. And let that spirit of death that sits around her, let it be arrested. In the mighty name of Jesus, I arrest you. And I pray and I thank you, Lord God, that you are causing her to walk into new places, restored places, and you're redeeming the time for her. Even now, Father, we thank you for your gift. We thank you for this intercessor. I unite my prayers with hers, Father. And I thank you that it's also even a sign that you're lifting her, Lord. You're raising her. For heaven hears her voice. And even the things that she's praying about now, Father, we thank you that you're bringing them to pass. Even the things that concern her. We thank you, Lord, for the acceleration. In Jesus' almighty name we pray. Amen and amen. My goodness. Dios. Jesus. Ah. Now let me help you. These types of prophecies are easy because I already saw the vision. I'm just telling you, it's right here in my notes. Amen. Amen.